The following trailer is rated H for honest. From the developers that basically created the first-person shooter genre and let you live out your fantasy of murdering robot Hitler, comes a series so violent and satanic it warped your fragile little child mind. Doom. In an era when video games were dominated by cartoonish mascots and kid-friendly themes, get ready for a game about maniacally gritting as you wade through a sea of corpses, where you'll descend into the depths of hell and fill every demon there full of white-hot lead until you run out of bullets and just rip them apart with your bare hands. Metal. Rev up the blood-spattered chainsaw of Doom Guy. A nameless marine protagonist taking on the legions of hell by himself for some reason. He's a ruthless killing machine with superhuman abilities, perfect for demon slaughter, featuring the accuracy to hit enemies above him while firing straight, the strength to carry every gun in the game at the same time, the fortitude to take a missile to the face and keep fighting, and the stamina to run full speed at all times. And he'll use these skills along with a plethora of satisfying weaponry to grind Lucifer's minions into a fleshy paste and take down the real master of hell, John Romero. <laughs> Discover the magic of Doom's ancient jury rig 3D engine, where you can't aim your gun up or down. The items and corpses are flat sprites that face you no matter where you go. And the map is an incomprehensible mess of ray-traced lines, causing you to get lost in the massive levels and forcing you to run around humping walls until you find a secret door. <laughs> then immediately get gangbanged by the angry demons inside of it. Circle strafe your way around the shambling legions of hell. Gruesome collections of bone, flesh, and guns that live only to murder you. As you deal with a brutally unfair enemy design featuring invisible demons, tiny flying demons that come out of nowhere, demons that spawn more tiny flying demons, demons that resurrect other demons, and demons that straight up murder you with rocket launchers. Because masochism is what video games were about in the 90s. No big deal if you die, though. You can always just respawn at the last checkpoint. At the very beginning of the level! <laughs> Experience the series that every first-person shooter was trying to emulate for the next decade. With a genre-defining original entry that introduced the world to the joys of serial murder with a minigun. A sequel that delivered more of the same, but bigger and better. And the much later third entry that looked really nice at the time but was dragged down by predictable AI, obvious monster closets and jump scares, and being dark as shit. Yet still wasn't half as bad as the Doom movie. Come on, Rock, you're better than this. Semper Fi, motherfucker. So strap on your green armor, power up your BFG, and blast your way through the daddy of all shooting games one more time before the new game turns it into Halo or something. Starring The Walking Dead, The Inhuman Torch, Bay Pig in Hell, Ghost Rider, Nightmare Fuel, The Amazing Spider-Man, Rocket Sands, Real Assholes, You're Gonna Have a Bad Time, I'm Your Mom, and Master Chief, Doom Talk to Me or My Son Ever Again. Did they hang Commander Keen? Man, that's real dark. Just Google it. Be sure to subscribe for more Honest Game Trailers and tell me what you'd like to hear me say in my awesome voice. A coconut is just a hairy milk carton. Look at those cheekbones. I could cut myself slapping that face. I am the pantsless crusader and I demand your respect. I'm blue. If I was green, I would die. Nintendo. Nintendo never changes.